Dad is gone. Press record. Okay, so she's a little bit excited. Mm -hmm. She's doing a destructive behavior. I'm going to get her into a flow and she's going to completely shift her. Come. Sit. I like that. Put your bed. On your bed. Good. Sit. Stay. One or two steps away, come back in, keeping her connected and in the flow. She is an aggressive chewer, chomper. So rather than doing a whole production and just doing this and being scared, I just let her have it, release by saying, let's go. Got her flowing kind of around the Pied Piper. Gonna take her past this line, sit, stay. Similar commands to over there. And a release, let's go. Good girl. No treats, just sequencing. On your bed, sit, stay. Step away, step away. Give the payment. My cheat date did all that for one kibble. All of that focus. Good. And the release. Let's go. Working a simple pattern like this is hypnotic. Look how calm she is. I'm going to take her past this line. I'm going to have her stop on this line. Stop. That's pretty good. Sit. She's got excitable nature. Stay. So I'm saying commands once. I'm saying them calmly. I'm saying them only when I've got the connection. We're tempering her with a long sit, not needing to give her a treat, not exciting her, and giving her the treat in a way that keeps her calm. Let's go. Sequencing back to the same predictable command coming up. Good. Sit. Stay. You can see how she's getting slower and calmer. Let's go. Let's go. Good girl. Sit. Giving her a minute. She's focused. She's, she's lost concentration. Sit. Good. Stay. When you walk away from the stay, you should ooh, show her. this off with a don't touch this. No. Now she's got her spot to lay down on. She's got her focus, her, her point of focus. She's got the connection with me. And so she's just going to go into relaxing like a good girl, which I like. So I'm going to pay her a buck for my hand, but not from there. And now we've got her hypnotized, calmer. So I can just hang out and drink my coffee with my guest. Blooper. Can you see how she's looking to me? Can I touch that? Can I touch that? She's also relaxing down. I don't know if you can catch this, but she's laying down. So this is a great technique for calming down overly excited dogs, channeling the excitement in a calm, productive way, a way that gives you an authority in the relationship, a calm authority and a way that the dog no likes. So how would I end this exercise? How could you end this exercise? You could stretch this last piece out as long as possible. Let's pretend it's been five minutes. There you go. And then you just put this away. Boom. And that's a wrap. So I can put that on YouTube and send it to Aaron. Right? Yeah. Cool.